my followers, I came to do a review on all my butterfly blades. So I have 14 blades. So I already you know the group them. You know, into two groups. One this group is ARC series. The other one this now first uh, first low is a CLC series. So let me share my story. The first blade I tried butterfly, right? Actually, you know, is that this color ARC. Um, not exactly. I was say maybe when I was in graduate school back to 2006 seven eight nine something like that my first pedal is butterfly cobia but after that i never try i just use the sticker uh, clip wood but now i just use butterfly so for butterfly this pedal is i first tried right after i try yeah i know it's really fast and the backhand is so good but the problem is also that uh, so the forehand. So let me introduce one by one first. Okay, so this one is Tim Timbo ARC. Timbo ARC. Could you see that? Timbo ARC. Right. Then this one. This color. This one Ning Gaoyu ARC. Then what we have, this one is a Fan Zhengdong ARC. Then, Zhang Jike ARC. I have two inner, inner world series. Harimoto inner frost ARC. And just inner frost layer ARC. So this one, inner frost layer ARC. Same for the outer layer. Oh, sorry, for the ARC. In the first layer, the ARC. The yellow one. Then I have this in the first layer, the ARC2, but it's named by Tiago Apronia, the ARC. Right? Tiago Apronia, the ARC. Then what I have, I have three outer layers, the ARC. Oh, this is uh, also in the two. This is Halimoto in the force super ZLC. Super ZLC. Then we have, we have this one. Mizutani ZLC. Right. It looks very beautiful. Then last one I have is uh, Lin Yun Lu. Lin Yun Ju. You know, from Taiwan. No. Super ZLC. Right, so let's go back story. This is blade I tried. So for the ARC series, I already arranged by the speed. So Halim, oh sorry, T-Mobile ARC, the first one. Then the second is this carrier. So now later I have one Ling Gaoyuan ARC, Fan Zhengdong ARC, Zhang Jike ARC, a bit slow, right? Maybe this team boy, a uh, high mode ARC, maybe as fast as the Fan Zhengdong ARC. Or put it here, Lin Gao ARC. Then slowest is Inner Force Layer ARC. You know, high mode Inner Force Layer ARC. You know, it's much faster, much faster than the Inner Force Layer ARC. But you know, if you look at the pedal size, right? In the for uh, Halimoto in the force ARC, the pedal size is a lot bigger than in the force ARC. So that's for the speed, right? Now I join the team for ARC too. So let me talk about the review. Base carrier, backhand perfect, it's automatic. Forehand, I think it's kind of you know, it's hard, it's hard for amateur players. It's good, it's really powerful, very comprehensive, very perfect blade, uh, blade but you need to be very powerful, you know, have very good fundamentals to master this piece, you know. 
so I don't use this very much now. You know? Right? And here is Timo Biasi. Timo Biasi, I feel, so, can, so feeling on the, on the hand, actually, I feel it's better than face color. Face color, sometimes you feel it's a little bit like, you know, uh, what's the, uh, kind of like stubborn like that. You can feel very well. So Timo Boy LLC, I have tried, right? So backhand, I tried Lozana, slow one, right? Kind of good too. I also tried T64 too, right? So backhand, also playing good forehand, very good, fast and easy to loop. The problem I feel is when you're off the table, you know, the ball don't, don't stay on the pedal very long. So when you're off the table, you want to maybe the ball fast, you want to loop, right? It's kind of it's hard because the ball doesn't stay very long. So that's a speed difference, right? Then, later I feel, you know, personally for me, I like Lean Going LLC, Functional LLC, kind of, you know, a little bit slow, but it's still fast, but you know, reduce speed a little bit, right? But it's kind of fast too. And also the control goes bad too. So, personally, you know, I like Lean Going LLC the best. I think it's a well-balanced pedal. Well balanced, I mean like on um, offense, defense, control, you know, counter loop, speed, speed, everything is like eight, eight out, eight out of ten. So it's very good. But the problem for Lin Gao Yuan is you know, because Lin Gao Yuan he doesn't sign up with the butterfly, butterfly now. So this product, you know, is discontinued. It was discontinued. So you don't have any choice. There's no replacement now. But I really like it. It makes my defense much better. My offense more stable, fast, and left, especially you know, a left light changeable, you know. Left light switch perfect. So later, because I want to find a replacement for Link Gun ALC, I got this Fountain Dome ALC. So I put a DO Technics on C O nine C on my backhand, and also ten H O five on my forehand. So what I found out, this this pedal actually fit me very well too. So the difference between the Gaoyuan A R C and the uh, Fanzhou A R C is you know compare you know so Fanzhou A R C it was slow, but it has more spin than the Gaoyuan A R C. And also the arch, relatively it's very long. And also, you know, it's good when you're off the table loop. It's really good this pedal. You know, you know, it will lose a little bit of speed, especially like you know, close the table, the forehand flick. Yeah, sometimes you know, just need to be you know, add more spin, as and more speed. So this is a good place for me actually for the incoming ARC. Then I have this Zhangjik ARC. Zhangjik ARC, you can definitely feel it's really soft, right? So. For me, T05 or D05 on my forehand may be no problem, but for me, at on backhand, I have to use a kind of hard rubber T64. Sometimes I even feel soft T, uh, feel soft if I use T64. Yeah, it's a very good bad pedal for loop, and also it's very good for every stroke. Right, you you are going to do, just add a power. Otherwise, you feel the you know. The, the pad is slow because it is soft. So Harley Motor ARC as as to speed actually it's maybe in uh, between in Gaoyuan ARC like that. So it's kind of fast fast blade, but it's in the ceiling, so it makes the outer layer very hard. That's why you know it's fast. So my feeling, this pedal is a very good control defense blade. You know, if you look at Harimoto, just backhand, you know, flake, backhand, block like that. But the forehand, not very good, you know, not, very, not much power. And also, I feel, you know, because the pedal size is kind of bigger than other pedals, right? So it's, it's, it's slow. Sometimes you feel, if you put it like two butterfly this series rubber, you can, you will feel maybe a little bit heavy. So it's very hard. It's kind of very slow between forehand and left hand switch. Then we have this in the first layer. ARC ceiling. 
This pedal, I think, can choose really good. I think it's a fixed uh, Korean player, Lee Sang Su, he uses too. I feel this pedal for me is too slow, you know, the block to stay on the pedal too, too, too long, you know, it's, it, it lost the speed, so I don't use it very much. But it's good for some kids to start using it, right? Okay, now we are going to switch to the butterfly CLC series. So still, I got the first I got is the inner force layer CLC. When I use it, control is good, loop of the table is perfect. The problem I for me is I feel it's a bit slow. You know, it's a good I was it's a good control defense blade. Like you know the, the Olympic champion Zhang Yining, he uses two, right? She uses two. She just like in a stay close table backhand block. So if you have a chance, then so she will try to loop like that. Right? I think for me it's too soft. And also the problem is like for man play. They look at the pedal size, the ha handle. Handle is kind of little small, so to make you grip and has it not very tight like that. The other thing the color is yellow, right? See this then? I just use a couple of times, not very long. You know, I, I, I didn't use it for what, years. Look at the panda, it's become dirty, you know. Then I got this one, Tiago Apronesias. I love it. So it has the same control as the other one. Maybe off the table spin on such jump, but it's good enough. I love this. I love this. So personally, for me, as an amped player, I like you know a pedal, you know good at looping, you know, you know what I mean. So like a curl table, flick all the table, you have a good defense loop like the other one is so fast, you know. But for for backhand, I like some thing like face color or Lin Gao Yun, very good block, you know, speed fast, you know. But forehand, I want more flexibility, freedom to adjust. So later I have this, you know, Harley Motor Super ZLC, you know, perfect. This pedal, the backhand is perfect. It's perfect as good as, you know, Face Collier and Li Yunju ZLC. But forehand, like I feel too, it's very too hard and not much, you know, flexibility over there, you know. It's a good blade for forehand and backhand defense, good too. But the reality speaking, is still the problem, you know, for this pedal, Harimoto Super ZLC, is a forehand. I also have this Mizutani, you know, ZLC. So compared to other outer layer ZLCs, I fear the first layer actually is not a coto, it's made of limbo wood. That's why you can feel the speed is slow, you know. Control is better compared to other series. I like this pedal, especially backhand, very good, automatic. As good as with Calvary. The problem is the forehand. Forehand, I can tell you, is very good looping, but not much speed. The kind of, you know, like, you know, Miss Tiny, just all the table loop, loop, you never make a mistake, but not aggressive, powerful, right? So the last Super ZLC, last the pen I'm going to talk about is the Lin Yunju Super ZLC. So actually, when I got it, I put a Lozano on my backhand. Perfect. So you can put any soft rubber. On the backhand, backhand flake block so good, but for forehand, I feel it's too hard. So especially over the table when you try to loop, it doesn't have much power. Also, the ball doesn't stay there. You know, the ball doesn't really go inside and come out. It's just like a steel, you know. But in the block, it's kind of good too. You know, it's very good for like you know counter loop or counter attack like that. Yes, but yeah. So I have talked all my. Butterfly pedals. So yeah, give me some comments or check us out my videos. Tell me what is my favorite blade. Uh, what is my favorite blade replacement? You know, actually I can tell you, I have kind of uh, probably you know four to five pedals I can always try, but mainly probably two to three is my. Is my is my folks yes so yes please leave any comments if you have any questions I will reply once I see it thank you bye bye if you like please give a thumb and also subscribe to the channel thank you